<laughs> Welcome to Spooktober. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to Dark Claire with um Outlast. A lot of shit was happening last time. And I thought we had to go back this way, but maybe not. But yeah, we were running from Wall Rider. And then Little Pig Fan. Free Little Pig Fan, as I like to call him. He's almost like the wolf because he's searching for the pig so much. Got whatever this is. Grated? Cheese grated? Both people? I'm honestly not sure. But anyway. Ooh, this is new. Billy. He takes care of me. He may think I'm his father. Oh, you're the doctor who created Wall Rider. Do you know what this symbol represents? Your company. Microscopic machines. Technology we have had for decades and never mastered. Okay. Find Billy in the main laboratory. Is that a knife? Do we have a knife? Oh no. That's, I thought we had a knife, but we don't. Something. Oh, I didn't get to see what he said. Main laboratory? No, cafeteria. Oh, look. Lovely. Hmm. Hmm. Sweet, that is sweet on the tongue. So is this game almost over? It looks like the game's almost over. How do I kill you? I'm meant to kill you, but I don't know how. Oh, you bastard. So I think I do what I did, but faster. Right. Let's just go. Right, no, not this way. Oh, piss off. Look, that won't stop you, will it? I don't think it's so. Oh, crap. How close are you? Don't gas me again. Just let me through, thank you. Right. Through here, shut the door. In here, shut this. I see, was there anything in there? Yes. 
one document. Let's see what it said. Do not worship the swarm, nor allow your delusions or the patience to influence your beliefs. Any sentient being based in this technology will be so far superior to us that their illusions and godliness will be reasonable. We have always looked into chaos and called it God. We are now blessed with sufficient power that such belief could destroy us. Do not be tempted. Remember that you are scientists. Looks like he believed. Don't know why I'm not recording. Okay. Extra note. The assembler. The feed chambers. The pers precursor modules. Vague memories and nanotechnology articles I've read online, probably drunk, probably distracted, not nearly enough to know how to destroy it. But Billy is the center of it. Find him, kill him, and this. Hello, Billy. Is this you, Billy? From Billy's patient records, he ought to be 23 years old. He looks at least 50 years of rough rude, of rough rude, pain scratched. Deep, deep into what I can see. Killing you would be an act of kindness. Right, let's read this last document. To avoid patient injury, the mass you... Uh, enriched oxygen... Oh, f bugger it. Put the end on. Fail safe is inactivated and can't be turned off. Hello. What are you gonna tell me? Anything? No. Just being a crap. I'm Bob and I'm a crap. <laughs> Look at me, I can do all these moves. Have you seen my crap darts? <laughs> to the Louis Spence or whatever the gay one is that like dances all the time. By gay, I mean he's actually gay, not... Oh, what a gay. Why... How do I turn him off? Okay. Something in this room. Am I sure it's not... Am I sure? I'm just going to check upstairs. But yeah, these doors are locked. And you can't do anything with these controls, so this is the escape room. Let's try and remember that. Okay, this looks right. By the way, I know I won't remember where the escape room is. Bloody know it. Oh, note again. This is Billy's hope lungs, his liver, his life support. A machine the size of a football stadium to keep one lunatic alive. Fuck it all, break it all, he has to die. Yep, and then we're gonna let all the psychopaths out into the world, aren't we? When really, we need to kill them all. Even us, actually. Just cause the world's gonna go to shit if we let everyone in here. Maybe you can go out because I don't know. Because you got the tapes. Cut the electric supply. Okay, how do I do that? Oh shit, the bloody ghost is having to me again. Yep, ghosty's got me. For the personal records of Dr. Wernicke, Frankenstein. Learn from me, if not by my precepts, at least from by my example. How dangerous is the acquirement of knowledge, and how much happier that modest man than he who aspires to become greater than his nat nature allows. Bastard.
run. I don't know where I'm going, just run. Oh shit, this is the wrong way. Keep running. Continue to run. But yep. Yeah. Billy is definitely who's controlling Wall Rider, that's why he's so pissless at the moment. Oh shit! Oh, that was, yeah. I'm an idiot. But yeah, it looks like we've almost bloody done this. I can't believe that we have. Oh shit, you're there. Why isn't that just dandy? Oh, now you're even closer. Because the violin's kicked in. And now you can't get to me. Good. Right. Let's continue on. Where I'm still gonna think that you're following me, so I'm keep gonna, gonna keep running. I just feel like running. Please find your attached permission to proceed from a, mo a massive hospital in Colorado. From his standard, all relevant lines have been signed. It appears Biddy is unaware of his mother's recent guided car. That oh. So she was arrested, so maybe she was mental too? He submitted to the experiment with the understanding of financial reinvention to his mother, the charitable contribution to our church. Oh shit. When the key, having read the boy's dreams report, he believes he's, he has an enormous therapeutic potential. So he thinks he's going to get normal, not least power in this machine. Okay, let's do the last bit of the stretch now. Just gotta go into that room. Power to fail safe. And where are you gonna be, Wall Rider? Where are you gonna be waiting for me? Because I know you are. So you're not gonna let me just get away with it, are you? Yep. You're gonna try and kill me. Oh no, you almost do manage to kill me. Don't know how I survived that before. Or well, didn't survive that before, but survived it now. But okay, you saved me the hassle of having to go downstairs. Thank you. However, you're now after me again, aren't you? Piss off, lad. There we go. Bye bye, Wall Rider. Uh oh. Here we go. Come on, kill Billy quick. Come on, Billy, die, die, die. Uh oh. Come on, Billy. You need to die. Come on, Billy. Die, die, die. Yes, you're dead. War Rider's gone. We're okay. Well, puff my fingers, obviously. With our crab hand hands.
get out. Don't you worry. What was the note? Actually, yeah, we've gone the wrong way, haven't we? Billy is dead. The wall rider, the swarm, whatever it is, I'm made with him. Whether I escape or die here, I am free. You know what I said? I'm going to forget where the escape is. Yeah, that's kind of happened. I think it's up here. It's, I think it's actually the escape we saw first of all, though. Don't die. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Come on. Don't die. We've got to get that message out there. Actually, I think whatever it was has probably stopped. But come on. You can do this. You can do this. Okay, maybe not get the camera out. But come on. You can do this. You can do this. Come on. Let's see if we can get the camera out again. There we go. Come on. You're almost there. Actually, there's no way he's going to make it. It's still a while off, isn't it? And it's not going to make us walk like this for ages. Come on. You can do this. So we finish the game with full battery left. Hello, Moose. Oh dear. And I knew you we were gonna die. Yep. Soldiers killed us in the end. God Himmer. You have become the host. Got him and him or you Oh no, we're wall rider now. Oh dear. We're now the most dangerous psychopath in existence. Oh. Oh! That's the end of the game! Okay. Would well, that end a lot quicker than I thought it would? I mean, I was going to try and fill the whole month out with it. And Soma, of course. But no, we've actually finished the game by now. Anyway, that was a very good game. But I don't know if I can call it the scariest game ever. I mean, it was scary, yeah. But, I mean, it wasn't making me constantly shit myself kind of thing. It had very good jump scares. But I think I only, like, fully screamed three times. Maybe that's just how... Maybe I'm just not, like, that reactant to, like, scary stuff. And I just kind of shrug it off. But there's adventure. Isn't the like if it was an adventure game kind of thing? Very good, brilliant actually. But yeah, I'm glad I've played that. Um. So yeah, that was. I think that was only like how much left have we still got the recording? Wait, because I tried to put these into half hour. So this is a 15 minute episode. So I put them into half an hour because I thought that's the only way I could get both games in. But I mean... Yeah, just... I finished this game a lot quicker than I expected. Now my cut's going to come up on the chair and purr really loudly so that you can all hear it, aren't you? Yep. Because you're a crap. You're a shit. You hear that purr? Yeah, imagine what it's... Like... It's probably quieter for you than it is for me. Hello, what do you want? What do you want? This is very unprofessional, you know. Coming up and bloody having a wander around when I'm recording. I'm going to try and take the mic away from you because you're a very loud parrot. Where are you going now? So this is um, what the next 15 minutes is going to be filled with. Me... Having a go at my cat for just wandering around the place. Don't do that. Wait. 
Now I've got to hold it in my hand because he's intensed on kissing it. Got to hold a microphone in my hand now. You are a naughty shit, aren't you? Hang on, let me take my drink away so that you don't knock that over. <laughs> Bloody hell. Hmm? I've got to keep this in as well. Because I don't feel that I can cut out bits of the credits. So, thank you for doing that. Thank you very much. What are you doing? Come on, what are you doing? Also, I'm sorry if you answered the question to the webcam thing and I haven't put webcam on for this one. But honestly, not to have a go at this game, but all you'd see is blank faces. Maybe it was because I was in normal mode. Maybe if I was in hard or a tense, then maybe it'd be a lot more scarier. So in future, I'm not going to play games on normal. Um, I mean, I didn't die that much anyway. But, yeah, just... I'll, when I'm playing games for you guys from now on, I'll try to do it above normal. But yeah, you've, you've got... Soma still, I think. You've still got Soma to watch, and... I might be getting a Whistleblower DLC. It depends how much time... I think uh, Soma's going to take to record, but yeah, just it really does depend on how much time. Because I want to get the plan was to get Outlast and Soma finished by the end of the month, which I've managed to do. I've actually managed to do that, but I don't know if. I start whistleblower if I'll get that finished because I kind of just want to have a month where I play the games just for that month and then finish them by the end of it. I mean we are only on the are only on the eighth plus about three videos plus the other three videos. So that's sixteen days added to eight, which is six plus eight. No, 16 plus 8, even as 24. So, we've got room, I think. But I don't know if you want Town of Salem, or if you want Whistleblower. Okay, here's a question for you. What do you, would you prefer? Would you prefer Whistleblower? Or would you prefer, actually I'll have to put it in the next video, won't I? Okay, you'll probably be, have been asked this question twice. But what would you prefer? Whistleblower? Or, um, oh, what's the screen just on? Okay. Would you prefer Whistleblower or would you... Wait, stop it. Just because it's cable doesn't mean you can attack it. Whistleblower DLC for Outlast or Town of Salem? Because I know a lot of people like Town of Salem. Because I generally get more views for that. But if people want the DLC Whistleblower... I'm going to give you that as well, slash instead. Okay, so that's all for now then. Outlast, very good game. But until next time, this had been Outlast. With me, Dark Lair, in Spooktober. Bye-bye. Goodbye.